Welcome to this channel. In this tutorial, we will perform the digital circuit simulation using KiCad tool. We will analyze the AND gate simulation with digital gates described at the transistor level. If you like this particular tutorial, I request you to subscribe to my channel below for more such videos. Double click on this particular schematic. So the schematic window or the schematic editor appears. Now click on add a symbol and this particular library loads. Now the global library appears and in the filter we have to search for 74H C00 so which is a NAND gate which is a two input NAND gate so place this particular two input NAND gate on the schematic window and click escape now place the cursor on the schematic and we have to select unit E which would define the VCC and the ground terminal for 74HC00 to input NAND gate. So place this on the schematic window. Next click on add symbol and we have to type piece wise. So we have to select the voltage source and place the voltage source on the schematic window. So we require two voltage source which would act as a pulse. So we would define 0 and 1 as an input using the pulse. Now place the third voltage source on the schematic window. Right click on that, click on properties and define the reference as VCC and define the value as 5 volt next click on add global label and define the label as pcc and place this particular label in order to rotate use the r button on the keyboard now click on add a power port and in the filter type ground and place this particular ground connection on the schematic window now click on wire and connect the global label VCC to pin number 14 and connect the global label VCC to pin number 1 of the voltage source and the terminal 2 is connected to the ground and the terminal 7 of 74HCCIC is connected to the ground next right click click on property define the reference as u1 and click ok now click on add a power port select the ground and place this particular ground connection on the schematic window now click on wire connect the terminal 2 of voltage source to the ground and the terminal 2 of the second voltage source to the ground. Now connect the terminal 1 of 74HC00 to the voltage source, the terminal 1 as well as, well as terminal 2. Now right click on the voltage source, define the reference as V in 1 and define the value as 0 and click on edit spice model and define the pulse initial value as 0 pulsed value as 5 volt delay time as 2 micro rise time as 10 nano fall time as 10 nano pulse width which is 2 microsecond and period 4 microsecond and click ok Similarly, right click on the second voltage source, 
click on property define the reference as v into define the value as 0 click on spice model select pulse define the initial value as 0 pulse value as 5 delay as 2 micro erase time as 10 nano fall time as 10 nano pulse width 2 micro period 4 microsecond and click ok now we have to define the model for our NAND gate so right click select property define the reference as u1 click on spice model select model select file and double click on the models and select this 74 h cng so this is a transistor level based model for the digital circuit and select the alternate node sequence as 1 2 3 14 and 7 and click ok now the model has been defined now what we need to do is that we have to place a label for ground as well as the input so place the label as 0 on all the ground connection now place the label in 1 which is input 1 on terminal 1 and place the label in 2 which is input 2 on the terminal 2 and place the label out across the terminal 3 now in order to verify the truth table for AND gate we require a NAND gate and a NOT gate the reason being is that in KCAD we don't have 7408 AND gate IC so in order to realize this let us follow this particular steps so now click on add a symbol and type 74HC04 now click on this and you can see that it's a hex inverter and you can see that there is no quad 2 input AND gate so we have to select this hex inverter or basically a NOT gate so click escape now we have to place the cursor on the schematic and select this particular unit G of hex inverter now place this on the schematic window click on add wire and connect the terminal 14 to VCC and connect the ground that is terminal 7 to the ground now connect the terminal 1 to terminal 3 of the NAND gate and right click click on property define the reference as U2 now right click and click on property define the reference as U2 and click on model select a file and we have to provide the path where we have this 74HC04 now click on alternate node sequence and define this alternate node sequence as 1 2 14 and 7 and click ok now we have to define the out and the 
ground for this particular circuit. So click on add label and define this label as out and place this particular label across the terminal 2 of 74H04. Now click on place and click on add text and type dot tran 1 nano and 8 microsecond and click ok and place this on the schematic window. Now save this particular schematic and click on inspect click on simulator. Now run this particular simulation and we can see that there is an error. So we have to define the model 0. What does this mean by that? So let us go back. You can see that we have not defined the 0 label for this particular ground. So click label and place this particular 0 across the ground connection for 74H C04. Now click on inspect, click on simulator, run this simulation. We can see that we have no errors. So click on add signal and place the signal V in that is we can see 0 and 1. Place the second input signal. So both are same. So now what we will do is that we will realize the and get to table. So 0 and 0 is 0, 0 and 1 is 0, 1 and 0 is 0 and 1 and 1 is 1. So go back and click on add signal, click on output, V out. So for 0 and 0 input it is 0. For 1 and 1, if the input is 1 and 1 then the output is 1. So we have realized this particular AND gate truth table using KiCad. Thank you for watching this tutorial. I hope this has helped your learning purpose. I request you to like, share and subscribe my channel below.